Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. It is us again from the San Luis Obispo County Animal Shelter, and we are down here with a house full of dogs and cats that need to get homes. Once again, a house full of dogs and cats. It doesn't seem to be getting any better, Deborah. No, not really. And you know, the holidays are coming. Uh, so we have to get these guys home for the holidays. This is no place to be on Thanksgiving or Christmas or even Halloween. No, and I think a, a clear uh, solution to the problem, guess what I'm going to say, is putting IDs on these animals. If animals come in with IDs on them, we can get them out of here, lickety-split, back to their homes. That's all we want to do. Get these guys into homes, keep them out of the shelters, so that we do have room when dogs that can no longer have the home that they have need to come here. We have space for them. So the fewer dogs in here, the better. The, few do the, be the more dogs in homes, the better, and that's our entire goal. Absolutely. That'll be the theme of this show. That would be the theme of this show. Let's get dogs moving, get them out of here, get them back to their owners, or get them adopted. Let's talk about this character here. I don't know why this dog is still here because dachshunds are so popular. He's the long-haired variety. You don't see those every day. He's beautiful. He's cute. He's energetic and fun. Why wouldn't somebody have already gotten Lucas out of here? I don't know. That's why we want to feature him. So people get a good look at the type of animal that we've got here at the shelter. Best pet store in the county. And he's really good with other dogs. We put him out there in the mosh pit of small dogs and he does great. So come on and take a look at Lucas. He's a great little guy. ID number 173194, Lucas. Okay, everybody, this is Tegan and she should go to an experienced dog handling family. She gets along well with other submissive dogs. She's a little on the alpha side. But the thing about her is she came in here with like 47 puppies, all of whom got adopted, and here's mommy still waiting to get her home. So if you are interested in a sweet girl who's good on the leash, is very affectionate with people, and does not much like the shelter, she's putting on that expression right now, please come check out Tegan. Her ID number is 194712. This is little Harper, very nice little dog, um, just about two years old. He's a little shy and timid in here, but coming around very nicely, getting over it in a hurry. An all-around nice dog that gets along well with other little dogs. His ID number is 195261. This is Harper. I don't have enough nice things to say about Pepper. This is as great a dog as you're ever going to meet. She's one of our volunteer picks of the month, which means half of her adoption fee is paid. That would save you some money. Um, she's a no cat dog. She will chase after cats, but she is so incredibly good with other dogs. And the nice thing about her is she's a lazy bone. She just likes to lay around, be mellow, be on your lap, be next to you, um, lay there like a big potato. But then when she gets with other dogs that like to play, she's, she's a crazy player. She'll play and play and play until she drops some exhaustion. Absolutely fabulous dog. She's about three years old, spayed female, wonderful volunteer pick of the month, Pepper. One nine three four seven six. This is Cato, another one of our little brown dogs down here at the shelter that sometimes gets lost in a crowd of little brown dogs, but he is special and wonderful. He's about four years old, a nice little guy, gets along great with other dogs, all around active, happy little boy. We think he's probably a mini pin dachshund mix, so he's an interesting looking little guy. His ID number is 195048. This is Cato. Shelter favorite, Josie. Look at that face. That is a beautiful dog. She's also another. We have two volunteer picks each month, and she is the other one, which means half of her adoption fee is paid. This is a brilliantly smart <laughs> dog. <laughs> She is funny. She is lively. She is incredible with other dogs. I put her out with five pound dogs and I put her out with hundred pound dogs and she plays appropriately with all of them. She does play fairly hard, but she seems to know she needs to tone it down if she's playing with a little guy. Um, she is a powerhouse. She's energetic. She do great in an active family that runs or jogs or hikes or something like that. Uh, but great with other dogs. She really should have another dog to play with because that is the joy of her life. She loves people. She loves to hug you, kiss you, and yes, she will knock you over. She could use a little tiny bit of training, but she is fabulous. We love her. So come take a look at our other volunteers pick of October. This is Josie, 193273. Look at that smile on her face. Is that a great face on this big old salami head? This is Hugo. He's just three years old. And unfortunately, his owners could no longer keep him. He is the nicest guy. He's the most lovable guy. He's a great boy. Hugo's ID number is 194276. 
this sweetheart lost her family and her home because of a, a housing situation that her family didn't have any control of. Very sad to turn her in. She is a great little dog. Um, she's about nine years old, so she is eligible for the senior rebate, which means if you adopt her, you get $35 back on her adoption fee. She's just a sweet older girl that needs a place to retire. But you know, at, at a dog like this, at nine years old, that's only probably half of her lifespan, so she's got a long time to go. Mina's ID number is 195665. Fabulously sweet dog. This is Buddy, whose owner could no longer keep him. Um, we don't have anything but great things to say about this dog. We put him out with lots of our other dogs. He gets along with everybody down here. He's sweet and affectionate, and he's just so loving. And he's a little scared down here, obviously. Poor guy. Um, Buddy is a neutered male, about three years old. His ID number is 926574. A nicer dog you will not meet. This is Dexter. He's just a six-month-old puppy. His owners couldn't keep him anymore. Um, he, was most, he lived mostly as an outside dog, so Dexter needs some training. Um, he's a very funny guy, though. He's, a, he's fabulous with other dogs. He lives to play with other dogs, and he really should go someplace where he's either going to be taken to the dog park to play all the time or there's another dog right there at home for him to play with because he lives for it. Dexter's ID number is 195791. What a cutie pie. All right, lovers of long-legged big dogs, we have a beaut down here. We have Moose. He is a really nice dog. He's pretty goofy. He's scared of cats. That's a good thing. His card actually says he's kind of a sissy with cats, but that, that's an excellent thing. Um, he's a little nervous around dogs of his own size or close to his own size. We tend to put him out here with the little dogs. He likes those. He's comfortable with that. But we're going to kind of sneak up on him and put slightly larger dogs in with him every time. So before he knows it, he'll be able to handle dogs of his own size. Not that we have one. <laughs> anyway, we can get close, though. Moose's ID number is 195664. Come on, you know you want a big lug in your life. We got one. Buy him. This is Nilla as a Nilla wafer. Look at that darling little dog. She is um, probably part Italian greyhound along with whatever else she's mixed with. She is a sweet little girl, very affectionate. She loves to sit on your lap, great on the leash, loves to walk, all around great dog. She is eight years old, although she does not look it or act it, and so she's, um, she gets the senior rebate, $35 back on her adoption fee. Um, not, that you, that, not that that's a reason to adopt her. You should adopt her because she's just a sweetie pie. Her ID number is 176010. This is Nilla. Oh, look at that. Come on. Come take her home. Here's a big old beautiful girl. This is Maybelline, American Bulldog Extraordinaire. All that great eyeliner around those pretty eyes got her her name. She is um, maybe four or five years old. She's a beauty. She's sweet. She seems to be very good with kids. She does not like cats. Oh, you know, not everybody likes cats. Uh, she's an all-around sweet, lovable, beautiful dog. Maybelline's ID number is 195084. Oh, this little guy is as cute as they come. This is little Chucky. He's another one with a senior rebate. He's 10 years old, but you know, that's only half a lifetime for a little chihuahua like that. He's the sweetest guy. His family lost their home or had to move or something. They couldn't keep him. Bums me out when these older guys land in here. So we're our big hearted people in San Luis Obispo County that want to adopt an older guy. He is so sweet. Plus Halloween's coming. You should have a Chucky in your house. So this is ID number 168226, Chucky. Chief is such a funny little guy. When he first got here, he frankly wasn't all that great with the little dogs. So we started putting him with the big female pits and stuff like that, and he did really good. And we have just found that um, he, now he's doing great with little dogs too, but he still does fabulously well with big dogs. Josie, who you saw earlier, is one of his playmates, and they just tear it up together. She knocks him all over the place, and he's cool with it. Chief's ID number is 194723, just three years old. This guy has a whole long life ahead of him, and he could be a lot of fun for you to have. A dog like Huck is why volunteers do what we do. We come down here and work with dogs like Huck who are just absolutely terrified. And slowly but surely, they become less and less terrified, more comfortable. I know he doesn't look that comfortable, but compared to the way he was, he's doing great. Huck was found um, in Atascadero, so if anyone's missing their doggy, we might possibly have him. Um, looks like he got a little bit of a wound while he was out there running around. We're taking care of that. Um, the much improved Huck's ID number is 195703. This is Honey. Yes, she has the senior rebate also. She's a little older gal. She's as sweet as she can be. She has the most fabulous underbite. 
Just a sweet lap dog needs to retire. Come on down and give her a retirement home. Be a sport. Honey's ID number is 195654. Look at how cute. Okay, everybody, this is a newcomer to the shelter. Uh, it is a male, about two years old. He was found in Paso Robles at Meadow Lark and Oriole. So is somebody out there in Paso missing their big old salami head of a dog? Um, we have him down here. Seems to be a nice guy. Uh, so if you're looking to adopt a chunky dude, come take a look at this one. He doesn't have a name yet, but he will soon if no one comes to claim him. His ID number is 195774. This is a cute little Shih Tzu that was found in the South County at Wood Green and Via Concha. So somebody must be missing their cute little Shih Tzu. He's only about four years old. He's a male. And if nobody comes to claim him, then he is up. Well, he's up for adoption now, as a matter of fact. He, we have named him Chester, and his ID number is 185918. Everyone wants a Shih Tzu. Well, this little girl, it's taken some work. She was so incredibly timid and afraid when she got to the shelter. She's doing better um, for the people that she knows well. She's pretty comfortable. She likes her lap time. She likes to be loved on. Um, she walks very well on a leash. So she's a nice little dog uh, who really, really needs to get out of here. Her ID number is 195531. Her name is Maple. Okay, I got to tell you, this is my favorite. I love this dog, you know. Nobody should lose their home when they're 11 years old. Um, but her owners, for whatever reason, could no longer keep her. Uh, she's about 11 years old. Becca is as, as lovely, as sweet, as gentle, and obviously by looking at her as miserable in this shelter as a dog can be. She just, I'm sure she cannot understand how after 11 years she ended up here. So she's a heartbreaker, and she is so sweet. She's also eligible for the senior adoption rebate, so you can get $35 back on her adoption fee. And we love her, and we want so much for her to get into a good home for the rest of her life. Becca's ID number is 162564. Oh, this is a sweet cutie pie. He's only eight months old. He's a border calling mix and just a great little puppy. He's a wonderful dog. His owners couldn't keep him for whatever reason, so we have him, and he needs to get out of here and get into a fun home. This dog needs to have some fun. His name is Mikey, and his ID number is 195780. Pomeranian fans, we have a cutie pie down here. This is Spike. He's just four years old. He's sweet as he can be. He was out there in the mosh pit with all the other little dogs today and having a great time. His ID number is 195809 Spike. This is Sam. She is the sweetest dog. She's gentle and sweet and wants to be on your lap and just wants love. And yes, she is eligible for the senior rebate, $35 back on your adoption fee. Um, well worth it. She's a fabulous dog. Sam's ID number is 195063. This is Shelby. She is a beautiful girl, just about two years old, young. Looks like she's already had some puppies. So she needs to get into a life where she just gets to relax and be a dog herself and not have to worry about having puppies or any of that stuff. Very nice dog. Shelby's ID number is 195508. Everybody is crazy about this dog down here at the shelter. Chip is as sweet as they can be. He's a beautiful dog. He's partially blind, which is probably the only reason he has not been adopted yet. It's certainly not his behavior. He's a great size. He's great with other dogs. He's wonderful to walk. Uh, his partial sight does not bother him one little bit. Um, he is just a happy, sweet, affectionate dog, as you can see. We love Chip. We hope, and, and half of his adoption fee has been paid as well, so we're helping to get him out of here. Chip's ID number is 161249. This little guy's got a great ski jump for a nose. I hope we get a picture of him from the side. He is the cutest thing. He's a newcomer to the shelter. He just got here on the 19th of October. He was found in Pismo Beach near P the Pismo Pier by the flagpole. So is somebody missing their darling little chihuahua mix? We have him down here, and he's a very nice dog. Uh, his ID number is 195802. And another little older guy who lost his home. This is kind of heartbreaking. This little guy's name is Coco. Um, his family just could not keep him anymore. And he is eligible for the senior rebate, $35 back on your adoption fee. Very nice little dog. Um, nothing bad to say about him. He's a good guy, needs a home. ID number is 176009. Coco, that is a cute dog. What? That is a face on that little guy. Sweet. This is Andy. His ID number is 195641. He's just, he's a nice little dog, does great with the other little dogs, needs a home. He's only two. Look at that face. Andy, 195641. 
I think this is an absolutely stunning dog. She is gorgeous. She has been named, I think, because of that Jezebel. Um, really beautiful girl. Um, she's a stray who was picked up on Lama Street, Lana Street in Paso Robles. She's wearing a spiked collar. She's a gorgeous thing. Somebody should have come looking for this dog, but apparently they didn't. So she's ours now and she is up for adoption. And I know she's good with several of the other dogs. She may be good with all of them. Um, absolutely. She will get you noticed. She is stunning. Jezebel's ID number is 195672. All right, Grover Beach. Somebody down there lost this dog and I cannot believe no one's looking for her. She came in as a stray on the 19th of October. Uh, she was found on the 700 block of Rockaway. She is adorable. She's young. She's about a year. She's probably a Bichon or a Maltese or some kind of mix. Maybe, maybe some poodle in there. I mean, she's adorable. Come on. Her ID number is 195718. Nine, and if her people don't come looking for her, then you can adopt this little baby. All right, Moro Bay. There's got to be Moro Bay looking for this guy, too. He was found on Paula Street on the 20th of October, and he's adorable. He's hilarious. He's young. He's cute. He's only about two. He's already been neutered. Somebody cares, and he's talking to you. Oh, and he's looking at you. Well, he's looking at him. Oh, my God, he's darling. One eight five three zero four. This is a little guy from Moro Bay. <laughs> Come on, seriously, is that the cutest thing ever? That's Rudolph. What a cutie pie. He was found in San Luis Obispo on the 12th of October. He is just as cute as he can be. Uh, come on, adopt him. He's only a year old. ID number 195650. Teeny, tiny, adorable Rudolph. In time for Christmas. Newcomer to the shelter. This little pug was found in Morro Bay on Highway 1 near Mindoro Street. Hey, that's out there where my mom lives, actually. Um, on the 19th of October. So somebody should be looking for their little pug. If not, and you're interested in him, come look at him fast because pugs get adopted way fast down here. ID number 195799. This is little Ricky. He's two years old. Somebody loves him a lot because half his adoption fee has been paid, so that would save you some money. He's a nice little guy, plays great with the little dogs, um, seems very, very house trained, uh, very affectionate, sweet, just a great little guy. And his tail wags all the time. Ricky's ID number is 195385. Well, it doesn't wag so much when he's on camera, but otherwise, his tail wags all the time. You wouldn't know to look at her, but this dog gets the most improved dog in the shelter award. When she came in here, you couldn't get anywhere near this dog. Um, she was terrified, and she would let you know your attentions were not welcome. Now she is loving and sweet, rolls over on her back for tummy rubs, wants to be on your lap, plays with other dogs, has a grand time here, lives with another dog here. She is basically kind of an issue-free dog after being one that we didn't know if we'd ever be able to handle. So there you go. Bubby is your miracle of the week. Her ID number is 194187. Absolutely precious little Bubby. This is Minnie and she's one of our works in progress. She also was terrified, didn't want you anywhere near her and she is making slow but steady improvement. She would love to be in a home where she can adjust and just be a happy little dog. Her ID number is 195 Five nine eight, and she would love to just go home with you, play with other dogs, and sit on your lap. This is Bob. He is classically cute. Perhaps you haven't noticed because you won't look at the camera, but he is a classic looking little terrier. Probably a Westie mix or something. He was left in our night kennels on the 15th of October. We've decided he is Bob, and he is cute. Plus, he's a nice little guy. His ID number is 195667. If you are attracted to this one, you better get in here fast because he will not last long. Okay, so we're starting out with our first cat. This is Maddie. He is an orange tabby on white. Very, very cute. He's just about 11 months old. That makes him just a bit out of kittenhood, and he's very delightful. His ID number is 195334, Maddie. Another orange on white. This big boy's name is Freddy. He is a big, handsome character, and Freddie just so happens to be our volunteer's pick of the month. One of them. We've got two this month. That means that Freddie's adoption fee, half of it, has already been paid for you. We're very motivated to get Freddie out of here. So, take a look at Freddie. He's a handsome character. Come on down and meet him, and if you fall in love, half his adoption fee has already been paid for you. So, consider Freddie. Our volunteers pick 194814. And here we've got Tristan. Tristan is a black cat, as you can see. We have a black cat rebate going. Anybody who adopts a black cat gets $25 back on their adoption fee. That's terrific. That is any of our black cats, not only Tristan. 
Tristan's ID number, 195281. Well, here's a cutie pie. This gal is only three months old, and she is a calico. Her name is Roxy, and her ID number is 195345. Roxy. Say hi to Chelsea. Chelsea is ID number 194084, and Chelsea is our other volunteer pick of the month. That means half her fee has already been paid for you. So, orange tabby, delightful. Females are rare in orange tabbies. Most of them are male. Only 10% are female, and Chelsea is one of the 10%. Very distinctive. ID number 194084, orange tabby Chelsea, half adoption fee paid. Here's a pretty black and white. Her name is Poofy, and she's just about eight months old. Just in kittenhood, really. ID number 195089, Poofy. Well, if you like big, handsome tabbies like I do, you're going to love Elway. He is a giant. He is ID number 195167, and he is fabulous. 195167, Elway. Here we have a sweet little petite black cat. Her name is Katie, and she is just adorable. Volunteers really, really love this cat. Her ID number, 193554, and Katie is eligible for the black cat rebates. So, consider Katie. 193554 and we'll rebate you 25 bucks on our adoption fee. Here's a very sweet little tabby. This is Pebbles. Pebbles is just five months old. ID number 194019. Pebbles. Well, here's a very take charge kind of cat. This is Rodrigo. He is big. He is beautiful, handsome, lovely eyes. ID number 194781. Rodrigo. Oh, hello, JJ. JJ's been napping. What else is there to do at this shelter? Very small spaces these cats live in. If you have any time on your hands to come down and volunteer, the cats would really, really appreciate it. Just getting a cat out of the cage, maybe grooming, petting, just talking to the cat makes that cat's day so much better and makes that cat way more adoptable. We could really use volunteers down here to work with the cats. So if you want to volunteer, consider coming down, filling out an application, and then you're on board with volunteering and helping the cats. For now, consider adopting one of them, specifically JJ. He is ID number 193493. Here's Rebecca. She is singing a song saying, why not come down here and adopt me? I want to go home with you or something like that. She is ID number 195443, Rebecca. Well, here's Manny looking straight at you saying, well, what's wrong with me? Come on down here and adopt me. I agree. Manny is a great cat. He's just about a year old. Tabby on white, ID number 195620. Here's a long-haired tortie. It could be a long-haired calico. I see some white there. It's Gingerella. I love that name. She is just about three years old. She is gorgeous. She is ID number 195474. Gingerella. Another big, handsome cat. Look at his gigantic head, and he's got a body that goes with it. He is a nice tabby. We're calling him Prince Al. He's just about three years old, and his ID number 195554. Here's an interestingly marked cat. This is Dahlia. She is just about a year old. Her ID number, 195250. Dahlia. Well, you um, Lynx Point Siamese lovers, here is Zinger. He's the guy for you. He is ID number, 195601. He is beautiful. Check out those eyes. 195601. Zinger. We had to wake Daniela up from her nap. There's not much to do here, as you can see. She is not even a year old, just about 11 months old, long-haired, black and white. ID number 195338, Daniela. Here's Casey. He's a nice orange tabby, just about 7 months old. ID number 195315. Here's Sam. He is ID number 195705, an orange on white. Very statuesque, him sitting there. ID number 195705, Sam. Here's a cute little gray cat, five months old. This is Buster, ID number 195652. There's a cutie pie just six months old. We found this cat on the 18th of October in Paso Robles on Paloma Drive. This cat is male, ID number 195771. Are you missing him? We found this cat on the 16th of October. We figured this cat is about eight years old. Orange tabby, as you can see. We found him in Paso Robles on Westfield. ID number 195742. 
Next up, we have Sasha. Sasha is a very pretty Lynx Point Siamese. Pretty blue eyes. ID number 195547. Sasha. Here's Pumpkin. He's a tabby on white. He is ID number 195593. Pumpkin. Here's a nice light gray tabby. This is Ringo, just about six months old. ID number 192557. Here's a real friendly tabby cat. This is Homer. ID number 195716. Homer. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat in Morro Bay on the 21st of October at the 200 block of Atascadero Road off of Highway 41. This cat's about a year old and female. ID number 195805. Are you missing her? Another big tabby. This is Tails. Tails is a male. ID number 195794. Tails. Here's another tabby on white. This is Tabitha. ID number 195538. Well, here's our first black and white tuxedo. This is Baby. Baby is a male. ID number 195770. So you tuxedo fans, come on in here and get Baby. 195770. Another Siamese. This is Kung Fu. Kung Fu is a male. ID number 195651. Here's a senior boy. This is Spot. Spot is about 10 years old and he needs a place to retire. Along with Spot goes a senior rebate. That's right. If you adopt Spot, you get $35 back on your adoption fee. Spot needs a nice place in the sun. Do you have that for him? ID number 195610. This cat's name is Kitty. She is ID number 195795 and she qualifies for the black cat rebate. She's just a year and a half old. 195795. Kitty. Say hi to Susie. Susie is just about six months old. She is black and white. ID number 195655. Susie. Here's a mostly white cat we're calling Ivory. Ivory is male. He's just about four years old. ID number 195687. Ivory. Well, here's a little Pearl. She's just terrified in here. This is not a really nice place for cats to be. Some of them get along better than others, and Pearl really is not one of them. She is very scared. Once again, if you come down here and volunteer, you can help us out with Pearl. Get her out of the cage, pet her, make her feel a lot more comfortable here. Or you could adopt her. She is just about four months old, and I know some people are crazy about gray cats. We don't have many of them. ID number 195653, Pearl. Here is Sweet Patches, long-haired as you can see, beautiful tabby on white. Just about two years old, Patches is female, ID number 195675, Patches. Pretty blue eyes again, this is Candy, a lilac point Siamese, ID number 195613. Candy. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat on the 17th of October in San Luis on the 2000 block of Hope. This cat is spayed, female, ID number 195754. Are you missing her? Here's a cute little buff colored tabby. This little guy is only eight months old, ID number 195718. Look at those pretty blue eyes on Vanessa. She is a seal point Siamese. Female, ID number 195686, Vanessa. So yeah, we still have kittens. This is a little sales pitch on the kittens. Of course, the kittens take away from our adult cats, which have a harder time getting adopted because of our kittens. So the takeaway message here is please spay and neuter your cats. If you've got cats at home, we don't need any more cats. These kittens have grown up at the shelter, and it's not a great place to grow up. So if you're looking for kittens, Come on down and adopt them out of the shelter, of course, and we've got a lot in foster also. But consider, seriously, spaying and neuter and telling everybody you know about spay and neuter. Here's a tabby on white. She is female. Her name is Nimue, ID number 195537. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. He, we found this cat on the 16th of October on the coast. Uh, he's about four years old. His ID number is 195717, and if he doesn't get returned to his owner, he's up for adoption, and we're calling him Jasper. 195717. Here's a distinctive-looking cat. We found this cat on the 17th of October, all white with blue eyes in the North County on Paloma Road. This cat is male, ID number 195751. Do you recognize him? And another newcomer to the shelter, we found this cat on the 12th of October in Paso Robles. This cat is a neutered male. We think he's about 10 years old. Are you missing your cat? 
ID number 195659.